Okay, this video clip is for my client who is out of the country and I'm checking on the tree for him. And um, this is a, a nut all oak. It's, it's coming out like gangbusters. So that was the thing we wanted to check on. What I'm trying to show you here is a little tiny little bit of, of leaf disease here. Oh, it's not a whole lot. See that distortion on this small leaf right here? There it is. Uh, there's also quite a lot of scale, which I noted the first time I was out here. See that? Bark scale. We want to treat for that. So yeah, I was... My plan was not to treat this tree in the spring until we saw whether it responded to our last treatment. And I just... I want to say it's really coming out like gangbusters. It looks great. Um, so the crown is putting on new foliage like crazy. Um, the I didn't expect the scale to be completely gone. This is dried out nicely, so it's um, there's, it's 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 dried out. There's still uh, you know some evidence that it was buried and was getting too much moisture. It is quite wet here, but I think we've stopped the head from hitting the tree itself, or at least I hope we have. It hasn't rained in like three days, but it looks like possibly the irrigation has come on. Um, there's this big girdling root and back that we talked about before that we left intact and didn't mess with. So I'm going to recommend that we that we uh, do the uh, do the other visit. Tree could look a heck of a lot worse. What we really want to do is prevent it from prematurely defoliating, and that's what happened last year. Was it had a lot of leaves, and I think it dumped a bunch of them around midsummer or or, or late summer or early fall. I don't remember exactly when. The tree was looking pretty rough. It's looking a lot better now. Um, I also want to point out this, uh, I think it's Tafrina, it's called. It's a leaf blister on this water oak. It's a nice water oak. It's in, it's in pretty decent shape. But that leaf blister is going to contribute to premature defoliation and stress out the tree over time. Remember, my objective as an arborist is really to make sure that every effort is made to keep as many leaves on the tree for as long of the growing season as possible and addressing that type of leaf blister early in the season is going to be an important component of that. Um, so email me if you have any questions and I hope you're enjoying your stay out of the country. I'll talk to you later. Thank you.